Alright, this is the third stream of Life is Strange. I did not expect to have to do this over three streams, but uh, circumstances dictated that I must. Which is a bit of a treat for those of you enjoying the streams. Uh, I'll give you a little bit of time to contemplate what's happened over the uh, past two streams of this game, so you can all mull over what you think is going to happen at the end, if it hasn't already been spoiled for you, of course. And, uh, yeah, so uh, I don't intend to drag this session out for too long because I would like to be able to get onto the second stream of the day which will be Attila, my first ever live stream of Attila. So uh, that will be following this if I manage to finish this before five o'clock because I got football, at, I got to go set off, set off for football at about five to six so that won't leave me much time for Attila so I'm, I'm race against the clock here but I'm not gonna rush, fear not. So, uh, without further ado, let's get this show on the road. Life is Strange, the finale of episode four. We're in the uh, Vortex Club looking for blood, baying for those baying wolves. The army. Okay, that was Chloe, where the hell are you? That was named in Attila the Baying Wolves. This is quite appropriate here. They're baying students. So we're looking for Chloe here. God knows where she stormed off to in a hurry. Hey, Stella. Uh, hi, Stella. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. What, blue hair? <laughs> Hot girl. She had blue hair. Oh, like there you go. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. This is not the time to be ass licking here. <laughs> hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. <laughs> I feel the need to have to shout here. You know, I, I think I'm actually really in a nightclub where you've got to shout at people because you can't hear a damn word they're saying. I don't like nightclubs. <laughs> right, let's pull back the curtains. There is a swimming pool here. Is this the school gym? The school pool or something? This is a bad idea. Drunk students and swimming pools should not mix. Seriously. Health and safety, man. I'm glad I'm playing this episode today and not yesterday, because yesterday, after the revelations that we've just we stumbled across, the whole body in the ground, I was very sad and upset and depressed. I would not be able to be in a party like I am now, bopping along to the beat. <laughs> Can this guy dance? Eh, uh, not really. I don't think I'm actually do much for the first 10 minutes, I've just been looking at people dancing. Come on! Some kind of dream night. Come on, Maxi! Let your hair down! <laughs> Now's not really the time. <laughs> hey, Brooke! Jealous Brooke! 
expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. So why are you here tonight? No homework? Boredom? Waiting? Have you seen Warren tonight? Why? You're the one going out with him. Uh, cut the jealousy, love. I, I am sorry Warren asked me to the movie, but you don't need to give me an attitude. I'd like to think I'm your friend. I know. I get salty when things don't go my way. I'm selfish while you go on a roof to help save your friend. You're not selfish, bro. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise. Kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Superpowers? Don't be ridiculous. Superpowers? You should get this stuff from. I don't think having superpowers would make my life easier. With great power comes great bullshit. I don't know. It would be pretty kick ass to battle super villains over Arcadia Bay. Well, the night is still young. So are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. Wow, we talked around. We're not good. Huh, drone dates, whatever next? You serve an alcohol in this club? Hello? What drinks are these? Energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has the booze. Of course, they won't be selling the booze overtly. Somebody live brought in the old hip flask, won't they, eh? Hip flask full of booze. There's Courtney drinking alone, without Taylor or Victoria. I wonder why. What did you say about kicking ass? Hello? It's a bit loud in here. Luke, I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? So good job it's not a, a, fa a face cam live stream. You do not want to see what I'm doing here. No big deal. Really? You look pretty yeah. fucking intense. Is Nathan bothering you? Oh wait, I did see Nathan today. Nurse in a busted face. I had dreams <laughs> that somebody finally kicked his ass. Oh well, Luke, sometimes dreams come true. Warren gave him an epic beatdown. Yes, give it up for brother Warren. Now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. That'll be hard to do when the Prescotts own the town. And the Vortex Club. I call it the Vortex Cult. Look at this crap. Dress code? VIP section? Lead us bullshit. Preach it, brother. Okay, I have to get going. Um, thanks for seeing me. Oh, thank you. For helping kids. And for keeping it real. Peace out. No one seems to know where Nathan is. Is he hiding or something? Oh my god! What in the blue hells? Bigfoot on otter action. Ah, oh, really? <laughs> hey, Elise. Whoa! You nasty bastards! Can we help her out? Can we rewind the time and save her? See if we can rewind the time and save her. Or maybe we just want an instant replay. Look out, Lisa. Oh. Of course you stepped up to protect me from another humiliating moment. Thank you, Max. I saved her. I shouldn't have saved her the first time. What I should have done is let her fall in again. <laughs> just for just for a laugh, you know, and then saved her. Like it's a New York club. 
Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. Good luck. VIP section. No running, no diving, no dancing on the flotation devices, no drinking, and uh, any other rules? Yeah. No pushing people with purple air in the pool. Buddy, you need to get a grip. Ah, the wit of the vortex. Ah! That's another rule I almost forgot to mention. <laughs> no fucking, yes. VIP only. Well, I've got superpowers. That should class me as a VIP, surely. Yes, you do suck. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay? I know okay. Caulfield <laughs> is not on any list for the Vortex Club. Nice try. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Uh-oh. We need to do something here. What do we need, we need to, to do? We need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Around the back door. Round the back door, that always works. As I said in the barn, there's always another way in. Right, I want to put one of these on. What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? Oh, no, no, no. Let's put one on. We need to blend in, you know what I mean? Okay, I've seen enough of that. I've seen enough of this party. It's giving me a headache. Ooh, a bit of silence. Hey. Is this the boys' toilets? Oh, more graffiti! Not anymore. Supermax. Yeah, baby. Supermax. More graffiti. I'm obsessed with the graffiti. What is this? What is this one? Can't see it. It's. Oh, that's quite inventive. Look at that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It just. Oh, I thought it was having a. A Wii is just. Talking into a smashed mirror. Another one that's drunk and spaced out. Yo, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. You want to get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. To me it sucks. There's glow sticks and, and, and swimming pools and everything and loud stupid music. What's the, it's a great party. Uh Nathan. Speaking of have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore tex club. Hortex. I hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? I don't want a uh, quick no, dab, I'm thank you. Justin, and I have to get going. And if Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. Yeah, go grind, buddy. Somebody else mentions my face, looking intense. I'm gonna smack him in theirs. My f what's wrong with my face? Oh, more graffiti. The graffiti police is here. The tide is turning. Exit the Vortex Club. Hmm. I heard somebody knocking on a door. I, oh, now we do have people going. Oh, uh, the. Don't mind me. Hello. More graffiti. Kill the Prescotts. Chloe must be around. She done all this. What? 
What's happened? I, th I oh, I thought I could hear knocking. Oh, somebody's bra. Hello, Gross. How did this even get here? <laughs> Who's this? Good night, sweet prince. Yeah, he's he's wasted. Somebody's either having sex or throwing up, or both. Ugh, Max. Oh my God. Well, there's Ronald. I need to move this guy out of the way of this door. Do I? I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Maybe. Uh. Uh. Powers? Rewind? Uh, it's got to be a way through. Maybe if we rewind. Maybe if we rewind whilst we're in here, something different will happen? Uh, do -do 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 -do. Nope, he's still there. He's still there. Can't go back any further. Oh, giving myself a headache. Okay. Uh, I don't think we're going anywhere in this toilet. Hmm. Let me think. Let me think. There's got to be another way in. She says. Let's speak to the bouncer. Hello there, buddy. I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Why isn't Courtney guarding the list for the VIP section? What did she say? Uh, I somehow need to get my name on the list, maybe? Um, let me get my bearings. Do, 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 do. Um, I really do not have a foggiest clue. It's got to be something in here. The game would not allow me to walk into here if it was not something to do within here. Maybe it has something to do with him. If I yo maximum blah 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 uh Dana. You're obviously not cool with Trevor dating Dana. I try to front like I was. When I saw them together, I came over to cry like a little bitch. No, it's it's more like somebody who's in pain. I'm sorry, Justin. But you're a cool, considerate guy, and you're gonna find somebody just as cool, minus the drama. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. Yeah, yeah, your face is uh, intense. No, I'm, I'm cool, Justin, and I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus, you're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. So he's gonna go get his board and grind. Very good. Go on then. No, seriously, I'm out of here. Oh, when everything isn't so fuzzy. What on earth? Hello, boys at the toilets. Could you provide me with some insight, please? <laughs> uh, who's who's here? Shooting hell, fire and brimstone. Okay, so I've talked to him, so maybe if I leave, he might. Maybe he'll cause trouble with the bounce. What's this? Apparently, Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. Bitch. Let me in! Yes, you do suck. Am I missing something blatantly obvious here? 
Alright, I'm not looking at the chat at the moment. Uh, I may open it up for advice in about two minutes' time. I'm just going to have one last look around here. Yes, uh, I'm back. You scared me for a sec. I was ready to duck. Didn't think you'd come back. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have a good time. Even if I hate most of them. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or Kate. She must know I'd punch her in the face. <laughs> I probably should just for Vortex Club posterity. I'm surprised that Blackwell is having a party after Kate almost jumped off a roof. I guess people are happy that Kate is okay now and we can party again. I'm just happy she's drawing again. She seems much better, and her mother is being so supportive for a change. Kate deserves that. I saw that the video got taken down, so I, I hope nobody posts it anywhere else. Is that naive? Look how fast people here forgot about Kate. They'll find some new Blackwell drama and forget about her video. So it goes. No doubt. Um, but I actually have to go now. I'll talk to you later, Alyssa. Talk to you later! Oh god, the music's getting worse. I really have to figure out where to go, otherwise I'm gonna... My ears are gonna bleed! Yeah, love it, love it. Just get me inside, will you? <laughs> hey Sarah, um, do you know that I personally put Max's name on the list? So you like decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> you're not in charge here. Wait, I, I just... Uh, oh my god, you're done! And you're off the list? You're Probably. done, girlfriend, you're done! Welcome to Shift the it! Just look at her and give her a, sm a sly smirk. Come on, you know you wanna. See ya! JJ, I do not like club music now. So his ass has to be here tonight. Oh! 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 Let me just have a breather from that racket! Oh dear. Okay. So I figured out what to do finally. Blew my neck. Took me a while. Uh, where are we? What time is it? No, 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 no. It's this one here. Thank you so much for coming by, Max. You lifted my heart. Oh. And there I was moaning when I was in there about wanting to get out as quick as possible because of the doom and gloom. I was so happy to see your smile again. You mean so much to me and to so many others. I have to go, but I also wanted to say have fun at the movies with Warren. He's so sweet, he brought by some school books I needed. Give him a hug from me. Oh. Yeah, when are we going to this movie? It's probably not the appropriate time, but... <laughs> it's a bit dark in here, isn't it? Hello! Let's go talk to a few people, eh? A bong? A bong. Give me a break. Is it me? What's up, Hayden? Oh, look. Up in the sky, it's Supermax here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some dank OG buds, so I can barely see you. Are these hotties next to me? I just vaped some... What did he say? I just vaped some dank... <laughs> the language these people use. It's almost like a foreign one. No. I want to find Nathan. Me too! He's supposed to be bringing some special party favors. Hope that the party you actually planned to 
party at the party. Not this week. So, has anybody here seen Nathan? I guess you have to go ask everybody here. Or, you can sit down and take a quick nap. What about Victoria? Go ask her yourself. I would, but like I said, I'm fucking Maybe you better take it easy to Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a vortex with a party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Jane. Just watch out for Nathan. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready to yeah, she's such a party pooper, isn't she? Yeah, thanks for the translation, guys. I've never heard of Dank before. That's the first time I've heard of that. I'm learning some new stuff from this game, I'm telling you. Not that I've ever used any of it, you know what I mean? I never find myself in... Uh... What the hell? What? Really? She's wasted and nobody is looking out for her. Nobody learns at Blackwell. Taylor! Max, you go, girl? Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? No, that's fine by me. He's been getting, like, too buggy and kind of scary. Victoria might know. How has Nathan been scary? I've always thought he was a creeper. Fun, but you can tell he doesn't give a shit about anybody. Is this why you want to be in a vortex club? No, Max. I'm like far from home at a great school. I want to learn things, make friends, and party. But when Kate was on the roof, I knew I'd gone too far. Kate was dosed at the last vortex club party by Nathan. So. You should avoid any drink here tonight. But trust me, I won't even drink my own water when Nathan is around now. He's a pharmacy simulator. I do have to go now. Look out for yourself, Taylor. And give my best to your mom. Oh, thanks, Max. She's doing great after her surgery. I'm glad to know you're looking out for us, too. Oh, yeah. Getting down with the music. <laughs> uh, I did go to uni, JJ. I'm a qualified teacher. I did four years at uh, teaching, teaching, was well, teaching university in Leeds, Horsforth Leeds, Trinity and All Saints. But I lived at home because I live in Leeds anyway, so I didn't really get too involved in the whole party atmosphere and all that sort of stuff. That oxygen kit might come in handy if somebody brings you. Barman, are you serving something here? I'm a bit parched. You got any Morgan Spice and Coke? <laughs> so the Vortex VIPs get real alcohol at their underage bar. Again. Pringles? Chips and crackers. Spare no expense, Vortex Club. Sorry, I'm just uh, watching the... Uh, Watching the dancing again. Do you, you don't actually see this in clubs, though. You don't see just random people stood by themselves dancing like idiots. At least the clubs I've been to, they tend to be all congregated in one big area. Ah, more Victoria. Is Victoria. Next Victoria. You think she's going to listen to you, Max? We can only try. I'm not trying to blame you. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. 
I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. Some wine. <laughs> More than stupid. It's mean. Hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Maybe I'm not her friend, but I didn't get off on Kate attempting suicide. I'm not evil, Max. I believe you, Victoria. But I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what? I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. Oh my god. Um, I suppose we're supposed to be buttering her up, maybe, so that she'll actually listen to us. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my photo. I'm not as talented as I thought. Yes, you are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. I hope. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Uh, no need. Not enemies, I think, is the one I want to choose here. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision, that would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's going to happen, but not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. We need to warn her. That's all we can do. We can only try. And I'm not going to rewind this. This is a one chance occurrence. <laughs> so if I get the wrong one, so be it. Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now. So listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace. Dark. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> she didn't believe us. But I am not fucking around. What a surprise. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little Little anymore. meltdowns? They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. I don't believe anything you say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just want to take your little retro selfies. That is uh. so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just go find a community college. <gasps> Victoria, please don't do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see him serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Maybe that's the wrong choice. Maybe we should have found another way to help her out. But, as I said, I am changing it. And if she comes a cropper, it's her own fault. Okay, I tried. She's not gonna believe me over her Vortex Club partner. Yeah, maybe we just made things worse. We just wound her up. And I've still got a couple of other people to speak to first, so before I go speak with Chloe, I'll speak with these guys. Son of a bitch is not here. Where are you? Can I talk to you for a second? Max, all right. I'll talk after you shake that boom for me. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, no. I can't even get Victoria or Taylor to twerk. And you want to hang with Nathan? Why? Business. 
You should talk to his dad then. Bro has got more money than God, and he spends it on the Vortex Club, not the losers over there in the cheap seats. Logan, this is a swimming pool. In other words, you haven't seen me. Ask Victoria. She always knows where he is. Why don't you ever want to see you, Max? You're so cute, and we never really talk. Yeah, I've done talking to this idiot. Logan, you're such a dick. You bailed on Dana when she was pregnant, right when she needed you most. Now you're trying to mac on me? Are you proud of yourself? Bro, you are giving me the full body tackle. I already feel like an ass for taking on Dana. How can I be an undick now? You could start by not trying to sex up every female in front of me. The rest is your choice. Use it well, bro. Oh, and don't ever touch Daniel DaCosta again. You will regret it. Ah! Now, excuse me. Look at her! That was way more exciting than the dance. Catch you later, Max. She got all nasty there for a minute. Right. Let's carry on talking to these people, giving them all words of warning. Maybe this will impact how many people end up dead. <laughs> Nice earrings. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. <laughs> He's so different than Logan. We actually talk about life. And he knows how to be safe. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. The Vortex Club is also enabling him. I know. Juliet wrote a story describing it like a cult, and I'm starting to think she was right. It's not fun anymore. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. That sounds like a plan, Peter. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. Yeah, he's a bit awkward. Yeah, yeah. A, bit, a bit clunky, a bit clumsy. Yeah, yeah, okay. He's trying, though. I love that Trevor doesn't care how goofy he dances in the VIP section. Hey DJ, can we put some different suit music on? Just one so one request? The Vortex Club actually hired DJ Doom for the party. Oh, there's a couple. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Excuse me, guys, sorry to intrude. So Juliet hooked up with Zachary again? Okay. She better be careful so he doesn't pull any revenge points. Good luck prizing them two apart. Any more graffiti? Yay! Fuck your selfie. Oh, that makes me want to pull a carry on the Vortex Club. Okay, we're done chitty chattying. Time to get to Chloe and see where we're going next. Things are about to go sour. I can feel it in my waters. Chloe's here. Well, she obviously didn't find Nathan. Come, let's go. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a uh, mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. What, in this racket? I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost lost. 
I'm almost on. It's big. A big appearance. Okay. Okay. Everybody, calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest. Why is he doing it here, of all places? Well, I do. I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about it. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Oh god, pass the sick bucket, the please. Envelope, please. You're all you're everyday nervous. heroes. <gasps> oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh god. Oh my god! Really? I can't believe it! Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name. Oh. And fame. Uh. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. I thought Thank she did, I thought she was doing art, not drama. Sorry. Bloody hell! Nice Sorry. act, love. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Well, yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the. Door you found a dead body. You know who's done it, you've got all the evidence, he, he could be have he could have weapons on him, you know, and you're not ringing the police, I mean, Christ. am I crazy here? He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard. No, 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 you gotta ring the police. That's what you gotta do. <laughs> I mean, for Christ's sake. Dear. Okay, what time are we on? Stop stomping around. Quarter to five. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. She's walking around with a gun. I mean, <laughs> this is ludicrous. Okay, here we go. She's got a gun, I've got a mobile phone with a light on. Maybe we should have called the police. Oh, what do you think? <laughs> yeah, my mobile phone will save me. What I do, if I, if I press the number 5 key, a force field will suddenly appear around me, and bullets will deflect from it. It's, uh, it's the iPhone 7 SG4. It's the new uh, feature. Hello. Come on, come on. Nathan needs to die now. Jesus, be quiet, okay? Just be you quiet. Have to be invisible. What with the light on your phone shining everywhere? Very invisible. Am I supposed to be following her? I'm providing. I'm providing the light. <laughs> I suppose I should be. When we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can Whoa. Get over and over. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, okay? We could die, okay? Yeah, we could. And if you do, I have no sympathy. Should have phoned the police. So creepy out here. Max, please hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. What's going on? Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh, no. You've been drugged. That was a very quick maneuver. Chloe. Look how what the fuck? <gasps> In the head! Oh my god! Chloe. 
Oh my god. This game! Ha, <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> oh. oh! Now that would have been a shock if I'd never read it first! Oh! My goodness! Uh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well. <laughs> Where do we go from here? Is it, I think it's, is it five episodes? Or, I think it's five. There's the, the next one is the last one. But it's always the guy you least expect. Hey, Mr. Jefferson. Everybody loves Mr. Jefferson. And he's the, he's, in, he's bloody caught up in the whole charade as well. Ah, oh, my God! So uh, yeah, Mr. Jefferson. Hopefully, those of you watching, some of it would be a surprise to some of you. Unfortunately, as I said before, I even started streaming this. Somebody had posted that on my uh, comments, which was a massive, massive uh, annoyance. But still, even seeing it, being told it, and seeing it, it's still quite shocking. You know. It's almost like you know it's going to happen, but you just don't want to see it. You just don't want to believe it. You can't be Mr. Jefferson, no! But it is. Mr. Jefferson, woof! Shot uh, in the head. Square in the head. Yeah, maybe maybe my senses were, were, were way off there, Coconut. Maybe they were... I don't know. I didn't suspect that at all. He was suspicious. <laughs> I think I might, Johnny. I think I might actually. I won't play the game again myself, but what I'll do, I, I, once I've finished all five episodes, what I intend to do is go and watch a couple of uh, LPs of it and see what other choices people made. And then when I know exactly what happens with the story, see if I can spot the clues and see if it all fits together, which I'm sure it will. Anyway, thank you all for coming for the third time. Uh, sorry it's taken so long, but uh, as I said, uh, it was a case of uh, football getting in the way and, and plans changing, which led to this having to stretch over uh, three parts. I would have preferred it over two. But uh, yeah, I, I, again, another highly enjoyable experience. This is proven to be a very good series. It's got its downfalls of course like any other game but on the whole I'm really really enjoying it so uh, episode 5 probably a couple of months away the, the, the big finale I mean I'm looking forward to it so uh, we'll see what happens but anyway enough chit chat it's now uh, uh, 10 to 5 which means I've got about an hour to load up Attila and start the Attila stream so uh, I'm gonna shut this down in the next couple of minutes head over to the Attila stream, which is on the front page of my channel, and I'll see you all in that chat room over there, and hopefully we'll get a nice 45 minutes of, uh, of Attila uh, as a little bit of a treat for you guys, because Attila hasn't been uploaded for quite a while. So, uh, see you all over there. Thanks for watching. Goodbye for now. Apparently there's a teaser for episode 5, so uh, I was just running through the various choices here. So let's go and see if we can see the, uh, the, the teaser. Oh my god, are we... Oh my god! Holy sh shooting balls.
Oh, episode five, polarized, coming soon. Oh dear, we are in a bit of a pickle. Just how are we going to get out of it? We'll have to find out next time. See you soon.